eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, zero, ignition, and lift off of the Falcon 9, go Starlink. liftoff of Falcon 9 Power from Space Launch Complex 40 for this 11th Starlink mission. The three planet Skysats and our 58 Starlink satellites are on their way to space. In about 10 seconds, we will be approaching max Q. Merlin engines Vehicle are now throttling supersonic. down as they anticipate the moment of greatest aerodynamic pressure. Max Q. All right, we just went through Max Q, and the vehicle is now supersonic. And Merlin engines have throttled back up. So coming up in about a minute, we'll have three events happening back to back. First will be main engine cutoff, or MECO. This is where all nine Merlin engines will shut off to slow the vehicle down in preparation for the second event, stage started. separation. This is where the first stage separates from the second stage with sta stage one starting to make its way back to Earth for landing, while second stage will kick off the third event of, in this sequence, SCS-1, or second engine start one. This is where that Merlin vacuum engine will ignite and begin to propel the second stage along with our payloads into orbit. Main engine cutoff coming up in about 20 seconds. Everything continuing to look nominal for stage one. We have Miko. Stage separation confirmed. And in back ignition. All right, so there we saw those three events all happen in quick succession. Stage one is now making its way back to Earth. There on the left-hand side of your screen, we can see the grid fins slowly deploying. And on the right-hand side of your screen, the Merlin vacuum engine beginning to develop that healthy orange glow as it continues its journey on to orbit. Fairing separation confirmed. We're just a few seconds away from fairing deployment. There we go, visual confirmation of fairing deployment. We, once again, as a reminder, we flew those fairings on a previous Starlink mission in January earlier this year. 